take it home. Okay. At the young age of three years old, in the height of the Christmas season, I went to Macy's with my mom for Christmas shopping. And this was a big old four-story department store. And while she wasn't looking, I ran off and I was hiding in the clothing racks. And about 25 minutes passed, um, store security was involved, and the store was on lockdown. Everyone was looking for me. Meanwhile, I was just hanging out in the dressing room, and I crawled underneath. And unfortunately for me, my adventure was over when my mom came in and found me. And she'll tell you to this day, I had the biggest smile on my face. I was just adventuring through Macy's, having the best time. <laughs> my name is Lauren, and I am a senior at LMU. And as you can tell by this story, I have a passion for adventure and exploring my surroundings. The first object, actually, I am going to describe myself in two objects. The first object is a family portrait. As you can see, I have Let's huge... hold on one second and just really quickly we'll do, so I'm going to tell you about what? Myself. Uh -huh. Two, two ways. Mm -hmm. uh, the first will be a? Family portrait. And then the other will be a? Can't wait. What is this adventure? Now let's give a transition. So first, I'll tell you a little bit about my, or this, my family picture, right? Yes. This family picture. And why would you tell us about that family picture? Because I, mean, I, I get to it. But yes, um, my family. <laughs> well, I understand that. Um, so we just need some kind of like that okay. transitional statement that lets us know what this purpose of this speech is. The purpose of this speech is to describe how. My family helps ground me, gives me the foundation to go out and travel and want to see the world. Um, yeah. Okay. So this is a portrait of my family. I'm one of nine kids. And from my older siblings, I get to look up to them. I'm mentored by them. I'm inspired by them. And then as an older sister myself, I am responsible, mature. I have like these motherly qualities. And then as a middle child, I'm very independent. I have a strong sense of self. Like I know who I am and what I want to do. This picture is important to me because it shows the most important people in my life. They support me, laugh with me, cry with me, and most importantly, inspire me to pursue my dreams. Mm. And one dream I had growing up was I wanted to travel. And my mom lived in Europe for some time. My family all traveled abroad. So I decided that this is what I wanted to do, like my family. Which brings me to my next object. Next, I have a passport. I have been to 15 countries, and I guess you could say at this point, as a 20-year-old, I've experienced a lot of the world. I have been able to see Pope Francis canonize four saints at the Vatican. Mm. <laughs> I got to experience St. Patrick's Day in Dublin, and I saw the birthplace of St. Ignatius, where he um, is now buried, and I have drinking limoncello looking at the, um, over the Amalfi Coast. So I've experienced all these things, and this passport to me reminds me of my time abroad, the people that I've met, the languages that I had to sort of pick up to communicate with the people there, and it reminds me of the beautiful places that I left bits and pieces of myself behind. And of course, the empty pages kind of remind me of all the places that I still want to go to. In closing, I have shown you two objects that are meaningful to me. The first, the family portrait, describes the people who are most important in my life. They have grounded me, laid this foundation for me, and have encouraged me to go and pursue my dreams of traveling. And second, my passion is traveling, as uh -huh. you can tell, and adventure. And just like the story at the beginning, um, in Macy's, I have this innate desire to leave my comfort zone and do something knowing that my family has a strong presence in my life, no matter where I am. Just like I was not afraid in that Macy's store, because I knew my mom was somewhere around there. So whether it's in a department store or anywhere else in the world, I hope you all have a passion for exploration because I believe that there's a little adventurer in all of us.